what I was curious about is how old were you when the first Blair Witch came out? Uh, I think I was about 14 or something, maybe 13. Nice. I was, I was um, very beginning of high school, so probably 14, maybe 13. And then I actually went to the movies to see Blair Witch Project with, uh, I was doing this like really, really low budget indie film nice. in my home state. And uh, we went to see the Blair Witch Project um, against my will. I, I was not a horror person at the time. It was, it was terrifying. I thought it was real, of course, just like everybody else did. Right. And, and then we went, to see, we went to see the movie. And it's, and it's crazy now to think of, like, I was telling somebody, I was, it's crazy to think, like, had I, I had no idea, you know, when I was 13 or 14 years old watching the Blair Witch Project on the, on the big screen that I would one day do the sequel, you know, like 16, 17 years later. Right. That, uh, insane. That's see. That's kind of what I was thinking. Is that you know you would you would have to have been like, you know, a teenager or like you know in high school at some you know somewhere in there, and that you probably saw the movie in the theater. Like I remember, I went. I'm I'm not that much older than you. I was like maybe out of high school by like a year or two when it came out, and uh, I went yeah. with my friend to see it like a week before it hit theaters at like a, you know, like an art house theater. And they handed us these like handouts that explained to us how the fit, you know, the video footage had been found in Maryland and blah, blah, blah. So like, not only did I think that it was real, like they were like pushing on us that it was real. So when I got done with it, I was like, holy shit, did we just watch people die on a movie? Like, (laughs) right. Yeah. People thought it was a snuff film. I, you know, it was, uh, I, you know, I, I left there being totally just uh, terrified. And when I, you know, I remember, I can actually remember having nightmares about it and then finding out that it was fake and, and being angry and being like, wait, I had nightmares because of this. <laughs> <laughs> so in the, in the original, you know, the, they talked when they, you know, finally revealed that it was a, a movie movie, they talked a lot about how some of, some of the reactions that they got from the actors was by, you know, they were just camping out in the woods and then like the director or producer or whatever would like run up and like shake the tent and like yell at them and stuff. Did they try to pull any of that kind of hijinks with you guys? Oh uh, yeah. Adam had a, had air horns that he called the scare horns. And um, I didn't experience this as much because my character doesn't have to go through that as much as the others, but he definitely pulled out air horns and would blast them at uh, intermittently and in just really random times and, uh, and get real startles and real jumps. And then, you know, the occasional Sasquatch costume in the woods from a PA and uh, and he was also a big uh, he he likes listening to Aleister Crowley, so he would make us listen to Aleister Crowley on like a, um, like a boom like a what is it called a, a Bose radio thing like a portable radio um, out in the woods. So we'd be shooting a scene, and then we'd have this like really really dark music playing. And uh, and James uh, Alan McCune, who plays James, was telling a story to me recently um, that he was talking with a makeup artist who was a day player on Blair Witch, and she was she seemed really quiet and kind of uh, upset. And he was like, are you okay? What's wrong? And, and she was like, well, I just wanted to tell you that there's something evil here. And, uh, and then she didn't work for us after that, after that day. So there was a lot of little things. But, I mean, you already have the elements of being in the woods and being, you know, they kill the work lights and stuff. And then you're just in the pitch black. And, and that's very real. And we were in remote woods. And, you know, you did hear things. And there were cougar sightings that week. And, you know. So we had we had uh, the real elements to, to to play off of, but we also had you know Adam's hijinks. So 